Hi everybody, Sister Scaleback, Kathy coming in for my week 14 RNY bypass update. I've done this video like three times <laughs> and uh, something always happens to mess it up. So uh, I'm going to start again. I started this journey at 361 and I had surgery June 16th, 2014 in Toronto, Ontario. <coughs> Pardon me, I'm still recovering from being sick. At that time of surgery, I was 339. And today, I of last week, I, I made Twonderland and uh, I was 298 point something. This week, from being sick all week, I managed to go back up to 301. I don't know how. I have been eating soup and a few crackers, but nothing like major. So maybe just laying around doing nothing. I don't know what it is. But I'm not going to worry about it because I have learned not to obsess over it. It's going to go back and, you know. But yeah, I gained. I don't... Well, anyway. I'm not worried about it. Um, let's see. I'm really excited for my husband. He's going to be having his orientation in another month or so. He's going to be having the vertical sleeve gastrectomy, hopefully. Here in Ontario, Canada, they prefer to give you R&Y at any chance they can get because that's their gold standard. And because we have healthcare covered, um, they kind of get to say what you have. <laughs> um, but if you have health issues that determine you need the sleeve, such as uh, you need to take NSAIDs for life, um, or you have some other serious health issues, they'll give you the sleeve. And I think my husband will qualify that for that because he does have some kidney issues and some herniated disc issues and that sort of thing. So I'm really excited for him. I'm going to go to all of his appointments with him and I got to try and keep it exciting for him because I've already been through it. It's going to be boring as heck for me, but I need to uh, keep positive for him and, and uh, yeah, I'm excited. So, um, I'm going to try and get him to do an update video with me one of these days. And, uh, he just walked in the room and is shaking his head right now. No, uh, he's a shy guy and he's not shy. Once you get to know him, he's very, very, uh, a bit of a jokester, but he doesn't do YouTube. He doesn't do computers. He doesn't talk to strangers until he gets to know you, you know. But we'll see how it goes. I, I'm pretty convincing. I might be able to. Um, anyway, I am looking forward to his journey. And I know that he is going to need a lot of support. Mostly because he's going to be having the sleeve. I had R&Y. But also because he's going to need something from a man's perspective. And I don't mean to be sexist. But I do think that there are some differences between men and women. Hopefully. <laughs> and... Um, so there's a lot of guys out there that have had the sleeve, even R&Y, but, you know, guys that he can follow and get a little bit of a perspective from. And girls, too, who've had the sleeve, not just guys. Um, so with that, I just want to give a few shout-outs. Um, I haven't really given a few shout-outs lately, and I have a, quite a few that I want to give because without you guys... You know, you guys have made the world of difference to me. And there's some very special people that I want to talk about uh, because, well, really. Otherwise, it would just be my husband that I would have to talk to and vice versa. Um, it's a great thing about YouTube. Don't mind my hat, by the way. I'm having a really bad hair day and I'm sick and I haven't washed my hair. So I am an Elvis fan, in case you were wondering. No, everyone knows I'm an Elvis fan. Uh, anyway. Okay, in our area, we have the Brave and Sassy crew. And these people are, are on YouTube, but they're also people that I've met in person and hang out with on occasion. And it's nice if you can have a local group in your area that you can meet with. Because there's nothing like being able to have clothing exchanges, one-on-one -on -one personal conversations. Um... You know, YouTube's very public, so if you want to have some personal conversations, it's great to have some people local. Um, and so our Brave and Sassy crew, uh, the ones that have YouTube, anyhow, uh, Karen Sorta of Fairy Tale, 
Uh, we usually meet at her house. Uh, although I'd like, him ha I'd like to have them over to my house soon because I have a huge yard as long as it's not snowing yet. Oh, did I say that word? Oh. Um, anyway, Karen Sorta Fairy Tale. S O R T and then A, not O F A. Because if you try and find it with O F, it won't work. Um, she's a terrific lady. And she's given me a lot of her clothes. She's lost a lot of her weight already. I'm pretty sure she's at goal. She's almost a year out. And she's she's a wonderful lady. So give her a try on YouTube. Down with Deb is another one that is, she's pre-op. Uh, she's had to have, uh, she's suffered from migraines for a few years. And really bad ones that kind of make you pass out. So she's had to have an occipital nerve transmitter put into the back of her head. That helps to um, control these migraines. And then once she gets that under control, she's having a few problems at the moment. And I hope, Deb, that they um, get fixed for you. Uh, then she'll be able to have the surgery. And I'm rooting for you, Deb. I hope you can get that soon. Um, <clears throat> Firefly RNY. Stephanie, she just had her surgery. Oh, a um, little bit over a week ago. So you're home now and you're going through the motions, learning your pouch and what it's all about. And I loved your one week video update. Um, I especially liked your comments about the nurses. That was terrific. Um, but you're doing great. I'm rooting for you. So good luck. And Tina Redham, R-E-D-D-O-M. Tina, you are hilarious. I laugh every time I hear your video. You, you give me a, I'm, I just love your videos. You give me such a great feeling and sometimes I'm laughing so hard I'm tears coming out of my eyes. So check Tina out. She is terrific. She's post-op as well, but she's on OptiFast right now. She's going to have surgery in two weeks. So if you want to follow somebody right from the beginning and get an idea, especially if you're pre-op, Tina Redham, R-E-D-D-O-M. Another pre-op, Jen's Jammin. J-E-N-N-S. J-A-M-M-I-N and she's pre-op as well but she's going to be having surgery soon too so give her a shout out as well on YouTube um, somebody that I want to talk about that's that's the Brave and Sassy crew the people that I know in person but somebody that I want to talk about my the very first person on YouTube I ever followed uh, her name is um, Trudy and her YouTube name is R-N-Y in Ontario She's three years post-op, and she has come a long way. If you go back and watch her beginning videos, those were the videos that I watched that helped me decide I was going to have this surgery. And um, I don't know her personally, but I've watched every single video, and she is a terrific lady who's gone through so much, so many changes, and her confidence, I could see it develop over the course of the three years it was wonderful to watch so give her a shout out and <clears throat> Leanne from my big adventure she had the sleeve uh, she went to Tijuana Mexico to have hers done and she changed my whole perspective on Mexico so just so you know I, I've always been afraid of Mexico thinking oh crime 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 you know it's dangerous but um, her and less of Sarah both less of Sarah also had hers done in Mexico so um, give those ladies a, a check. Uh, Leanne is about four weeks further out than I am. And I love her videos. She's a sweet lady. And Leanne, I am doing your challenge. She challenged all of her viewers to, um, to do exercise for an hour um, every day for three days a week. Or to look at a before and after picture or to curb your nighttime snacking and only have one snack after supper between bed so um, I'm doing the exercise one and she's doing a uh, jewels giveaway because she does her own custom jewelry um, to anybody who takes up that challenge <coughs> pardon me a sleeve rocker sleeve rocker I think it's Pete is it Pete yes I think um, I love watching your videos because you are into fitness. He is a, a fit guy and he, you can tell he's lost a lot of weight and he's done it while building muscle. Um, so 
he's going to be on the Bariatric Divas show this Friday. If you look up Bariatric Divas, I'm sure most of you have heard of them. If not, you should check them out. Um, and the, he's going to be talking about fitness. And I really highly recommend that you watch that because um, I personally could use some advice. And he's going to, not just from a fit perspective, but he's going to start from the beginning and work his way through. So Sleeve Rocker, I really like your updates. Keep them coming. Um, Tina Marie RNY, you're a sweet lady. You're always there. I, I think of you as the mother of RNY because you're always watching YouTube videos. You're always leaving comments. Uh, you're, you're the sweetest lady that I think I know on YouTube. So please keep those comments coming because it makes me motivated and, and you're positive and I love positivity. Let's see. Robin from Robin's R&Y Mission. She's pre-op as well, but she did a video every day in August <clears throat> for, um, you know, that special thing where they do a video every day. And I got so used to it that when it stopped at the end of August, I'm like, oh, I miss her. Where's her videos? I'm not seeing enough of you. So I can hardly wait for your updates when they come in because all of a sudden it was like my, my daily dose ended. <laughs> uh, Diane, Diane's RNY Road to a New Life is her YouTube channel. And, um, She's a terrific lady as well, and she's had a few setbacks um, over the last few months, and uh, and I hope it's going better now, Diane. And I'm I'm I won't say worried for you, but I'm I was worried for you, really, really worried for you. And now that you're back and you're recovered, I hope it continues to recover nicely for you. Keep making those updates because I love watching your videos. VSG Gary, you just had your sleeve uh, about. Four weeks ago and um, my husband I'm definitely gonna have my husband follow your channel as well get the guy's perspective and um, and an older perspective um, not not to say that you're old but an older perspective is a lot different than a 20 year old's perspective and so um, my husband's 50 this year throwing him a big 50 birthday bash uh, and he needs to have um, some reassurance basically um, yeah, guys, reassurance. Lauren from Sweets 4200, S-W-E-E-T-Z, because Canadians say Z, not Z. Uh, Sweets 4200, you're a sweet lady too, and I love following your updates, so keep those coming as well. And I love your kids. They're cute. And your husband's hilarious. <laughs> he always jumps into her videos. He always video bombs her. That's that's just too funny. Dixie, 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 VSG Southern Belle. Now, I'm an Elvis fan, okay? So when I hear Dixie, first of all, and Southern Belle, <laughs> oh, Dixie, I've always loved you just because of your name. And then when I met you and you know, on YouTube and I watched you, I just, I fell in love with you. You are, you are so sweet and so gentle. Um, I love watching you and I'm going to be so happy when you have your surgery. I think I might cry when you actually have your surgery because I'll be so happy for you. And you've waited and struggled so hard to get this surgery and I know it's going to make a world of difference in your life. So keep your videos coming because I want to see you afterwards uh, melting away. Erin Sill, S-I-L-L. -L. She's a few weeks further out than, than me. She was um, uh, three or four weeks before me. And I love following her updates as well. Of course, I think we all do that. We all follow people that are close to our own surgery date. So that not that we're supposed to compare, but we do. But we're not supposed to. Uh, James R and Y guy, I love your videos as well. Um, I haven't seen one from you in a while, so hopefully, hopefully, you'll make one. I saw that you visited Gastric Rose and uh, Gastric Rose and her sister Connie, uh, quilting Connie B. Those are two ladies that are also my go-to ladies when I watch YouTube. They're they're close to my age, and of course, Gastric Rose has had hers over 10 years ago, maybe even longer. And 
uh, Connie has had hers three or four years. So um, <clears throat> they're twin sisters and and they're hilarious and they're sweet and I love watching them. Um, now, for all you ladies out there, oh, wait, before I get there, Ryan's Journey. I love Ryan's Journey updates as well. I love your son and I love where you live. You live in such a beautiful area and I love your updates. They're always so bright and inspiring. So keep those coming as well, Ryan. I love that. Um, but for all you ladies out there that really want to learn how to get fit without going to a gym right away, or, you know, if you're a little anxious about that, Ghrelin Be Gone. I followed her and she started out not fit. And she did home weights and tension bandages. And she go, if you watch from the beginning, you'll see her progress and how she did a home routine. And that girl's got some guns, let me tell you. She's got really well-toned arms. Like, think Michelle Obama. Like, the girl is fit. Um, I'm sure eventually she she went to a gym. But in the beginning, when you're, you don't feel comfortable sometimes going to a gym when you're big. Um, this is the girl to watch to see how to get into starting your fitness. So Grell and Begone, you don't post often either, but I love your videos and uh, you're very inspiring and you're very fit and it's awesome to see. Um, Fat Kings, of course, my husband's going to be watching you guys because you're guys and uh, he needs to have um, a male perspective. So he's already watched a few of yours. Um, and then Less of Sarah and Gooch Monster are going to have a joint channel. Well, they already do, but I don't think they've posted to it yet. And it's uh, LOS Monster. Is that Lost Monster? I don't know if that's how I'm supposed to say it or if it's Less of Sarah Monster. No. Lost Monster. LOS Monster. VSG. They're going to be doing a, a couples who've had surgery um, channel. And since my husband's going to be having the surgery, oh, I'm excited. Uh, this is going to be great because uh, it'll be a good perspective and, um, you know, there's times right now where I don't think my husband always understands what I've gone through or what I'm going through. Um, but yeah, I mean, he's a very understanding guy, but truly understands, you know what I'm saying? And once he has the surgery, I think he will. And I think it'll be nice to have the support of a couple's channel like that. So give them a check out as well. Uh, I think that's it. I'm sorry I went on so long, guys, but I wanted to make sure to get everybody in. <clears throat> VSG Bobby is another one that I um, also watch. And Evelina, Evelina Makes Changes is her channel. She also uh, just had surgery about four weeks ago. She's a sweet lady, very sweet lady. Um, uh, she has a lot of health tips. Um, she showed how to dehydrate food. Um, she talks about how to make your own underarm deodorant, um, you know, the natural way. There's all kinds of things that she's done that has really helped me uh, with tips. So give her a check. And also seeking Shayla. Shayla, you found yourself a new beau. She's my surgery sister. She had surgery the same day as me. She's in Florida. But you found yourself a new beau. I'm so happy for you. I, I love looking at your pictures now because the smile is priceless. So look at what surgery can do, the confidence it gives you and the new doors that it opens. I'm happy for you, Sheila. Um, let me see. Did I miss anybody? Tina Marie, RNY, I think I said a shout out to you, but you're like the mother of all surgery. Um, I, I think of you as a mother of RNY. I think, I think I said that. So... Um, please keep posting. I love your videos and I love the fact that you're always there for everybody. VSG Spike, you just had surgery. I'm so proud of you. I'm so happy for you. I heard that you're recovering well and um, you do terrific video montages. Let me just tell you with the music, that was terrific. So I think I have everybody. I hope I didn't miss anybody. I'm sure I did miss people as everybody always says. Uh, that's I tried to write down as many as I could, though. If I've missed you, though, I'll try and catch you another time. I watch a lot more videos than just those people, just so you know. Um, but I can't go through the entire YouTube list or I'd be here all day because I'm already at 20 minutes. Um, that's it, guys. I have gained a little bit this week, but I'm going to go back down, so don't worry about that. I'm back into Wonderland soon. I hope you all have a great week. 
Thanks so much to all my subscribers, to my new ones, and to the ones that have hung out with me since the very beginning. I, I really appreciate you. If you leave comments down below, let me know uh, if you have a channel. I'll go over and subscribe to you as well because I love watching and learning. And that's it for now. We'll talk to you next week. Bye, everybody.